for Jesus Ministries. Stand up for Jesus. I'm gonna stand up and praise his name. I'm gonna stand up for Jesus. So I'm so glad he died for me. And now thanks to him, I've been set free. Stand up for Jesus, I'm gonna stand up for Jesus, I'm gonna stand up and praise his name, I'm gonna stand up for Jesus. And now let us hear the word of God. Standing for Jesus Ministries is brought to you in part by the following. McDowell Professional Pharmacy. Call 377-1088. Lenny Hall Income Tax and Accounting. Call 377-2633. And by Nelson Fraser Funeral Homes. With offices in Martin and Hyman. Call 285-5155. standing for Jesus Ministries today we thank God for another opportunity maybe to bring the word to you to say something that might touch your heart and so thank God for the songs and thank God for all the things that he's given us and you know as we got ready to film the program today we got to thinking about how the temptation is everywhere you look anymore that all you got to do is turn your TV on and, 
or whatever, and you're not careful, their devil's got temptation thrown right in your face of all sorts. And I begin to think and I begin to study about how the, the Pharisees and all of them came to Jesus one time. And I listened, they come to him and they ask him, said, So, Lord, is it lawful? to give unto Caesar or not, trying to tempt him. Now, we're going to read that scripture here just in a minute. You be very much in prayer for us because, listen, we need to learn the tricks of the devil because he's, he's got a lot of tricks out there. And if you want to read along in the, uh, I think it's the 22nd chapter of Matthew, about the 15th verse, says, Then went the Pharisees and took counsel how they might entangle him in his words. And they sent out unto him their disciples with the Herodians, saying, Master, we know that thou art true and teachest the ways of God in truth. Neither carest thou for any man, for thou regardest not the person of men. Tell us, therefore, what think thou, uh, is it lawful to give tribute unto Caesar or not? But Jesus perceived their wickedness and said, Why tempt ye, ye me, ye hypocrites? Show me the tribute money. And they brought unto him a penny. And he said unto them, Whose is this image and subscription? And they said unto him, Caesar's. Then saith he unto them, Render therefore unto Caesar the things which be Caesar's, and unto God the things that are God's. And when they had all heard these words, they marveled, and left him and went their way. Amen. And I began to think, now here is the Son of God. And trying to trap him in his words, the people were to, I don't know, maybe to accuse him of something because they didn't want to accept him for what he is. And Amen. And, and if God will bless, we'd like to kind of preach on that a little bit. And if we ever want to see heaven, we want to accept God for what he is. And that's exactly what he is. He is the Lord of Lords and the King of Kings. He is the Almighty. The Bible says, In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. Nothing that was made was made, but without God it was. <laughs> Amen. God was there in the beginning, the Father and the Son. <laughs> listen, and I want you to know that, listen, people today will try to entangle God's Word <laughs> and make it sound so, <laughs> listen, so hard to understand sometimes. <laughs> And God says salvation is not that hard, my friend. All you got to do is believe. Listen, the Bible says that there were many believers, listen, that walked with Jesus. Listen, there were many of them that walked with him. Listen, then all of a sudden they were gone. Listen, and Jesus asked them, said, the disciples said, will you go always? I'll go too. Listen, one of the disciples said, Lord, you have the words of life. Uh, where can we go? Uh, uh, listen, but with you. Uh, uh, listen, because they realized who they were following, my friend. Uh, uh, listen, I want you to know. Uh, uh, listen, we stand outside the world, the Bible says. Uh, uh, listen, we're in this world, but we need to be standing outside. Uh, uh, listen, uh, uh, stand aside. Uh, uh, listen, what are you talking about, preacher? Uh, uh, my friend, I believe we need to. Uh, uh, listen, uh, uh, be a light, that city that sits on a hill. Uh, uh, listen, that can be hid. Uh, uh, listen, we need to render unto God the things that be God. Uh, uh, listen, the praise and worship uh, uh, that he deserves, my friend. Uh, uh, listen, I want you to know uh, today that people are scared. Uh, uh, people are afraid to praise his holy name. Uh, uh, listen, people, uh, uh, listen, are afraid to lift hands up, uh, uh, my friend, and give God the glory uh, uh, that he deserves. Uh, uh, listen, but now people's not ashamed to go uh, uh, listen to a ball game somewhere. Uh, uh, listen, 